Oh, Chica. Chica. I love you, Chica. Mwah. Okay. Um, don't know where that came from. Hey guys, it's Kitten, and oh my god, another bed vlog. I think I'm gonna make this like a place for my mental health um, videos because like I'm just so comfy here. Anyway, I don't know why, but like a lot of shit, like a lot of shit, like with my family is happening in the past month and it's just like, I don't know why, but it's like packed in like the, the a span of like four weeks. For something like for a process like this, it's kind of a short time. Um, especially with, like, the multiple things that are happening that are actually related to each other. <sighs> okay, first big update is that my brother is, uh, moving back in. <sighs> I've probably mentioned him before, but this brother, not the other brother, the other brother is awesome and sweet and is living with his girlfriend in, in uh, Sacramento, so he's not moving back in. It's the other brother who is a douchebag that's moving back in. Uh, because of that, we had to move a bunch of shit out of the downstairs bedroom. And that, for those of you that have visited my house, none of you have. And the downstairs bedroom is, was full of shit. Like a bunch of shit. Like, there was like, two foot with paths that went into the room, but the rest of it was just shit. So, uh, we had to clear out enough room for a bed. And, but, uh, some things, well, not, not some things. One thing in particular was moved up to my room, and I'm not very happy about it. Uh, partly because it's, super big and inconvenient and why is it in this room when it should be actually in my wall yeah see that that is an actual window against the wall between the bed and the wall a window <sighs> it's supposed to be the window that that that's right there but nope it's right here oh that's new too yeah wasn't very happy about that I'll get to that in a second. So anyway, yeah, that happened, which sort of covered up a plug that I needed, but I found a way to still use it. So yeah, mm, stretches. Okay. Another uh, well, that that's kind of inconvenient in itself because my my asshole brother, like why I said you, I probably mentioned it before. He's had a, had a big part in not making my depression any better when he was living here. My sister helped too with that. My sister and and this particular brother aren't the best. I mean she's she's like one hundred percent like pushy boss dominant shit like that. What she says goes and shit like that. And it's just, she abuses her, her older sister powers way too much. And then with my brother, he kind of does the same. He abuses his older brother powers way too much. But it's a lot more than that. He's not very, he's not very like a positive person to be around. He, he yeah, he's, not, he's just a not a very positive person. Like... Not saying that, like, I don't do that, but, like, he cusses every other word. He cusses out people when they don't deserve it. Like, when it was not necessary or, like, provoked or anything. He he used to smoke, and then he stopped smoking, and then me and my mom suspect that he started smoking again. He doesn't bathe, so he fucking smells. Like, seriously... Like, it's, it's so bad. He's just very negative. Like, he has a very, 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 very negative look on particularly, like, our family and his life. So, there's many, there's been very many occasions where he has cussed out my mom, he's cussed out my sister, he's cussed out me. Like, and he's also physically hurt me. So, it's just, 
he's not very, he's not very positive. He's not very good to be around. I'm not afraid of him, but I'm, like, afraid of, like, his negativity, like, fucking with the progression of my depression that I've repressed so much. There's that, but, like, for those of you that don't know, my sister, actually, she fucking, she doesn't live here. She has her own fucking apartment with her fiancé, but she lives here 50% of the time because apparently it's easier for her because her work is, like, closer to this house than her apartment. So for the past, like, year, she's been here 50% of her time. It's been okay. I've been kind like, actually, depression-wise, like, I've been doing okay with just her because my brother used to not come around all that, like, often, maybe, like, once a month, and that's it. But, like, what I'm afraid of is with them both in the house, for one, they fucking hate each other. Like, they, like, my brother fucking hates my sister beyond anything, and my sister just doesn't like my brother, so she kind of feeds into his hate for her, and they just hate each other. But the thing is, usually in that hate, if they do something that, like, if I do something, or, I, like, not even if I do anything, if I'm, like, there, they, both of them usually team up and, and target me, which makes no sense. Like, honestly, I think it's just because they're both upset, and I'm the younger sibling that they can take their anger out of, and they just target me, and, like, that's, that's... That's why when, like, everyone, like, all my siblings were living here, like, my depression was at its worst because, like, I had these two siblings that would not let up. They would, like, keep berating me and making me feel shitty and just making me feel the ugliest person ever and the dumbest person ever. And, like, honestly, that has not changed. Like... Their personalities are still the same. Like, they're still, they're both still assholes. I'm just worried that, like, they're gonna influence me so much that I'm gonna relapse with my depression. And that's like, like, when I found out that my brother was moving back in, like, I remember starting, like, starting to bawl because that, I was so afraid of that. Because, like, I don't want that to happen. <sighs> That's that's my one big issue with this. It's, it's just I don't want either of them. There's a lot of things that, like, they pulled the older sibling card on, like, when I was younger in high school. And, like, I I remember, I like, I have memories where I was actually doing homework on the computer. And we have, like, one family computer. And I was doing homework on the computer. And, like, I remember either... My sister or my brother walk up to me and they're like, I need to even use the computer. And I'm like, no, I'm, I'm doing homework. Go away. Like, we would argue about it. And then, like, either they would force me out of the chair, like, physically, or go get a parent to force me out of the chair, like, from the computer so they could use it. And it's stupid. It honestly is. So I brought that up to my mom. Like, I don't, if I'm doing something, like, I, I don't want them to pull the fucking older uh, child card to get their way because, let's be honest, like, I'm the only, I am literally only the only child that, like, is still living here. Like, my sister has her own apartment and is, is actually buying her first fucking house. And my brother is going to temporarily, we, like, we hope is going to temporarily, like, be living here. He finds his own place soon. Neither of them have, like, have, like, any ties to this house. So, it's really just me and my parents now. Uh, which is a little sad on my part, but, hey, free food. Um, <laughs> glory being the youngest, I guess. I don't know. Oh, another thing that I'm I'm a little like actually I'm not a little I'm I'm very pissed about and I'm very worried about is that since I uh, said my 
Since I said my sister is actually buying her first house, I don't know why, but my dad is like, is pushing the fact that he wants my, my desk, who is, it's actually my sister's, but like, my, my sister, I know she doesn't really need it or she doesn't really want it, but my dad is like, you need to take that dresser. You need to take the, the, the dresser and the desk out of, out of Jessica's room. And you just need to, need to take them out to your, your new house, blah, 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 blah. And I actually, I, I talked to my sister about this. And like, she acted like she didn't really want them, but like, dad was like kind of insistent about it, so she was just gonna do it. Which makes no sense, honestly. I mean, she's not gonna use this fucking desk. And she's not gonna use that dresser. So it's just, it's stupid. So, it. <sighs> so stupid and for you for for those of you that know have actually been watching my videos for the past like month two months uh i've been filming in front of that dresser so if that goes i'm just like where the fuck am i supposed to be filming yay my idea of what i think i will do is I'm going to want to move the, that dresser because this is the dresser that I'm apparently supposed to be using once that dresser leaves. And I, I really want to just move that dresser over here. Um, I may film in front of that, but if you notice, it's really dark. Like, that's a very dark wood. So, I don't know how it's going to go. Like, I'll probably be able to do it, but, like, I don't know if it's actually, like, appealing to look at for a dark background in a video. A lot of videos I've watched that are, like, professional and good and shit are, like, lighter backgrounds. So, I don't know how that's gonna go. So, yeah. Hmm. Don't worry about, like, all the shit. Um, I still have those spaces in the wall that I can put shit in. So... Probably all my books are gonna go in there, so that's okay. Oh look, look at my Harry Potter cards. You can't really tell who they are, but it's Hufflepuff and Ravenclaw. Look at them. Chocolate frog cards, yo. Anyway, um that painting that painting right there is actually not mine, by the way. It's my sister's. That one's mine. Tell the difference? I don't know. Oh, Chica! Chica! I love you, Chica! Mwah. Okay, um, don't know where that came from. Like, I'm okay mentally right right now, like, in the past few weeks. I'm okay. But, like, I'll have to get back to you when, like, all this shit is, like, finalized. So, yay. <sighs> yeah, my brother hasn't moved in yet. And my sister is in the middle of buying her house, so. We don't know, like, when she buys that house, how much time she's going to be. Um, staying here so we don't know. I hope that she, she goes because I've noticed that like if I have to deal with just one sibling, I'm fine. I'm completely okay. But if it's both, then we're in trouble. So yay. Uh, yeah, okay. I'm gonna go. Actually, side note, that dresser, the dark wood dresser, I secretly like.